inside this container I'm going to answer each of them pronoun for Tala, Nathan and Robin my answer is they and them second question pronoun for plants my answer is it and it. Third question. To write carelessly. My answer is scribble. The spelling is S C R I B B L E. Pronoun for a bird. My answer is it and it. Pronoun for you and I. The answer is us and we. Next question. Cabbage. Big or small idea? Give examples. Cabbage, eggplant, squash. What is it? Cabbage? Cabbage, eggplant, and squash. Is that a big idea or a small idea? A small idea. So what is the big idea of cabbage, squash, and eggplant? Vegetables. Pronoun for Kiko and Jenny. The answer is them and they. Living room. Big or small idea? Give examples. Living room, kitchen, and bedroom. Living room, kitchen, and bedroom. Is it a big idea or a small idea? A small idea. What is the big idea? The big idea is the parts of the house. Big or small idea? Planets. Give examples. Planets. Is it a small or a big idea? Big idea. Don't give me five examples of a planet or give me the small ideas mercury venus earth mars jupiter <music> to have a hard time the answer is struggle the spelling is s t r u g g l e next question what is a pronoun? A pronoun is a word that takes the place from a noun. What is a noun? A noun is a name, a name that can be a person, a place, or a thing. Okay. Big idea or small idea? Pencil, ruler, eraser. Give examples. What's that? Eraser, pencil, pencil and? Ruler. Ruler. Is it a small or a big idea? A small idea. What is a big idea? The things from school. Next question. Big or small idea? Body parts. Give examples. Body parts. Is it a big or a small idea? 
a big idea. So give me examples or the small ideas of the body parts. Eyes, ears, nose. To be carried through the air like COVID. The answer is airborne. The spelling is A-I-R-B-O-R-N-E. Pronoun for mommy. The answer is she and her. Small or big idea. Verbs, action words. Give examples. Verbs or action words. Is it a big idea or a small idea? A big idea. Give me small ideas of verbs. Run, walk, touch. That's one. Drink. To be short and thick. The answer is Stumpy. The spelling is S-T-U-N-P-Y. To be strong and capable. The answer is Mightily. The spelling is M-I-G-H-T-I-L-Y. Last one. To be deeply sorry. The answer is apologize. The spelling is A-P-O-L-O-G-I-Z-E. That's right. Finish with English. On to the next subject.